How are you going? We are in a group of um, four. My name is Kevin. Start off. Derek and me. Taking a little Hello. And um, unfortunately, Derek Hanna could be with us today, but we have to walk away without him. First, I start off by health and safety around the farm. Health, health and safety is various around all farms throughout the world. Our project will be taking talking about different various health and safety checks. I'll start you off with slurry tanks. Um, slurry tanks are the most dangerous. Slurry lagoons, as you can see in the photos, are um, well fenced off by mesh. Um, they are 1.8 metres high and um, also have lockable gates and um, for agitators of work to be needed throughout the summer. Also, another danger phase of a farm is a bull. A bull is took out from the cows and is placed in a field or a shed on its own. It's very dangerous in the, the, summer, the winter time before the cows are start to calve. We would advise you to stay away from them because you could, they could be angry at the start. He could pin you up against the wall or could charge as you are nearly fit. Also, every bull should be ringed on the nose at ten to eight to ten month old. Also, while in every farm, when you're walking the machine behind the tractor, you must use the PTO. A power takeoff cover on the shaft is a lot safer if you want the cover. If you don't have the cover, you get wrapped in it. We don't want that. So we are advising you to get um, a <coughs> cover in all um, PGO shafts and you don't know, obviously you want to live and enjoy yourself so without getting hot to the farms so make sure you have the cover. Also all farms nowadays have calving gates. Calving gates are a very good project that was made because when calving a cow it's a lot safer when trying to put a cow under a calf under a calf. A calf under a cow. Um, it could be a lot harder with other strange cows start kicking and just a lot easier can you as you can see you put them in. And um, that's why you should have a uh, calf in yet. Born by a uh, Irish agency that promotes the producing of Irish food. Coming from the local farms as they try to support local farms and the food they produce. Board Bia was founded in 1994 by the Don to small farms around the country to promote the food they were producing. In our class, in our group, we love to win the calves. Basically, we love to win the calves because we can have the opportunity to rare feed calves. We would like to rear them in fresh straw bedding and we would like to feed them hay sizes also by eating the lawyers and ration water for drinking in the summertime. We would also love to put them out in fresh grazing so they can graze. Also, we would like the team to win the calves so we can pick all our names for all every calf we win. Cool. So we thought it would be a good idea to pick ball games that we really liked. The first one is uh, Operation. Uh, we thought we could use this to warn kids about manholes and slurry pits and dangerous machinery to stay away from them. Uh, we'd also like to substitute the bones for farm hazards. Uh, another one we picked is um, farm safety board games. I think it would teach young kids the importance of farm safety and keep them aware of their surroundings on a farm and show them the dangers on the farm. And then we thought we could make a card game for farm safety snap. Uh, this concept involves a deck of custom ca ca farm safety cards uh, like animal warning signs. You can see one there. Thanks, Tony. Thanks, Tony.